YouTubers, once again, this is me, Ada, and um, this time I would like to tell you, to talk to you about an experience that I had uh, like 15, 16 years ago. I had a vision. This is not a dream, uh, not that I, not something that I thought I, you know, I saw and it, it didn't happen. It was actually a vision. I was wide awake. It was daylight. Um, and uh, that's the only, the only time that I recall having a vision. I've never had a vision like this in my whole life. I mean, this was an, a one-time only experience. But anyways, um, by then, I was living in Puerto Rico because uh, I come from Puerto Rico and uh, it was days you know during the day and I was in my room uh, giving the bottle to my oldest daughter she's 15 uh, 15 years old now by then she was like probably three or four months old so I was giving her the bottle you know in my room and rocking her on a rocking chair uh, and you know, s you know, singing to her, you know, trying to make her fall asleep, whatever, so I could put her in a in her crib, and then I could uh, do other stuff during the day. It was around probably 1:30 in the afternoon. So anyway, um, she fell asleep, and I started. Uh, well, I I put her in her crib so she could go to bed she, so she could go to sleep and I started praying I started you know worshiping God I was not praying for anything in particular I was just you know conversating with him um, <coughs> I'm sorry worshiping and praising him and all of a sudden I don't know how I see myself looking through a tiny hole and uh, it, that tiny hole started growing and growing and getting big and all of a sudden I see myself flying on top of the island of Puerto Rico okay how did that happen I don't know um, but I see the whole island uh, from the top looking down and all of a sudden I see the whole island shaking like a big earthquake and um, on the southwest part of the island I see as if something invisible because and I say invisible because I could not see what it was all I saw was the aftermath of whatever happened you know when you're eating a sandwich and the bread is not toasted but it's still soft and you take a bite and uh, you see the your the marks of your teeth marked on the bread that's what I saw like something invisible bit uh, part of the south southwest part of the island and I saw you know from the air I saw the new topography of the island it was like that you know with the, with the mark of something that had teeth I don't know how to explain it but that's the most you know close thing that I can compare it to anyway all of a sudden I see uh, the island stop shaking you know the earthquake stop and I see from the east coast um, a huge tsunami but of course in, in, in my vision I'm looking at all of this I didn't say tsunami. Oh, I, I saw this huge thing, you know, trying to cover the island. And uh, in, in my vision, I say, oh, God, please, you know, have mercy. Be merciful with the island of Puerto Rico. Uh, and then all of a sudden, I, you know, when, I'm, when I see that the, the tsunami is about to cover the island from the east side from the east coast 
that's when I all of a sudden I'm you know I'm sitting on you know on my uh, rocking chair the rocking chair that I was rocking my baby daughter uh, previously and I started shaking and I asked God in prayer I, I you know I knelt down on my knees and I said God why am I seeing this what is what is it that is going to happen show me talk to me tell me what is going on and um, I open up the Bible at random and uh, I can't remember right now the uh, the Bible verse or the Bible chapter that you know it opened to but I think it was Ezekiel something and you know that sometimes you have like the titles on top of whatever the chapter is about it read something like the sharp sword of Jehovah and when I read the whole chapter it was a chapter talking about judgment because people turned away or turn their backs to God, to Yahweh. So, and I had this a long time ago. It's been 16 years out, 16 years now. Uh, nothing has happened, but um, and, and a lot of people talk about they have had dreams or visions, revelations that there's going to be an earthquake in the island of Puerto Rico. I don't know if I was revealed the same thing. All I can say is, you know. We will know. Time will tell whether this dream, or I'm, I'm sorry, th it was not a dream. It was a vision because, I, like I said, I was wide awake. I was not sleeping. I was just praying and worshiping God, praising God, and then all of a sudden I, I lived this experience, which, of course, that was the only time that I had. I never had an experience like this before. But um, time will tell if this will happen or not. I believe if God is showing you something, He shows whatever for a reason. And if this is going to happen, then, like I said, time will tell. We don't know. I don't know. So, let's see what happens. I hope not. I don't live over there anymore. But I pray. I pray every single day for my family, my people over there, the whole island of Puerto Rico. And um, let's see what happens. I hope nothing bad. So anyway, I hope uh, you can share with me your experiences too if you had something similar. Uh, until then, God bless you. Bye-bye.